Hi everyone and welcome to a quick Goon Squad tutorial. My name is Zero and I'll be teaching you slash rushing you through another educational experience. So say you're in Blender and you run into this problem. You have your mesh object and you're about to combine all the pieces. So I'm just going to grab this real quick. Press G. Oh wait, I forgot to put the display again. Alright. That's what it's like a running gag with my story, my tutorial. So I always forget to put the display on. Okay, so you select all the link parts that make up your mesh object and you go over to the object tool and you hit join and you lose your texture. And then when you try to apply the texture back to it, like so, it comes out like this, like a solid and the UV mapping is all wrong. So how do you fix this from happening? First thing you'll need to do is download, ooh, excuse me, you'll need to download sparkles. And if you looked at episode zero, then you should already have it. So let's get out of edit mode real quick and go back to when I joined it. So with our mesh already joined, we're going to select it, go into edit mode by pressing tab, press A twice to select everything. Then we're going to create a new window and then make the window the UV editor like I always do over here. And inside the UV editor, you're going to press the N key and scroll down until you see the sparkle tools and here it will say copy UV faces and you're going to see from and to you're going to leave it at from and check all the boxes that however many all of them and then press copy to and it will be whatever map at the bottom and that will do it so when we go over here to put our texture back on so tab A and then put the baked head texture on you see, I have textures are like this. So that's how you join a mesh and keep all the texture information. Hope this thing, this was extremely frustrating to me when I had figured it out. And I actually had Gaia Clary herself explain it to me. So this is a special tutorial with superstar backing. <laughs> anyway, I hope this props you, helps you guys out. And I hope that your projects go smoothly after having this error fixed for you. Uh, bye and good luck.